Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook, Global Beastmaster. My battle pet is twice as much as others 36. Chapter 36. Comma comma. Ha. Su Bai made a doubtful voice, and there was an extra skill. Although the lightning bolt is not the special skill of Fengli Zanying, spherical lightning, it is not small in power. The key is that with the blessing of the legendary talent Thunder Avatar, this rare level skill can definitely exert the power comparable to ordinary epic skills. Even go beyond. Moreover, the electricity type skills all have paralysis properties. If the enemy treats his Sky Steel Crow as a normal Sky Steel Crow, he will definitely suffer a big loss. I've made a lot of money. Su Bai was very excited, then remembered something, and muttered to himself, by the way, look at my own attributes to see if I can get two battle pet slots. Open black lens bracket name close black lens bracket, Su Bai. Current level, bronze lower level. Talent, double contract. Battle pet 1, iron beak sparrow. Battle pet 2, phantom butterfly. Battle pet 3, vacant. Battle pet 4, vacant. Evolution point 1, comma comma. It's confirmed, it is true that every time you upgrade, you can get two battle pet slots. The successive surprises made Su Bai, who originally thought he had a strong ability to accept, stand up subconsciously, waved his hand abruptly, and burst out laughing. With such a powerful talent, the future looks bright. Boy Su, what are you laughing at? You're so happy. Yu Nan pushed the door open and walked in. Then with her eyesight, she could easily see the difference in Su Bai at this moment. Oh, you've upgraded again, right? Yu Nan's tone didn't fluctuate, as if he was talking about a very common thing. Well, wasn't it just upgraded last week, and now it's not a big deal to upgrade to the bronze level? Yu Nan said this to himself, and then the more he thought about it, the more angry he got, he grabbed Su Bai's ear and shouted angrily, Boy Su, explain to me clearly what's going on. Shang Xingbang passing by showed a sympathetic expression, then spat again, and cursed in a low voice, let your kid have two legs. The previous fight between Yu Nan and Sister Li had made the other members of the regiment regard Su Bai as a playboy, and they were very envious and jealous of it. Now that Yu Nan wanted to explain, Shang Xingbang immediately thought that Su Bai must have made a mistake, which caused Yu to be furious. At this time, Su Bai, who didn't know that he had already been killed by his reputation, was smiling all over his face, and said, Sister Yu, let go, my ears are about to fall off. Yo, what happened, it's so lively. Sister Li appeared at the door, and then also noticed Su Bai's change, rushed in immediately, and slammed the door shut. Shang Xingbang suddenly felt heartbroken. Unexpectedly, the two roses of their number 13 hunting group were picked by one person. After being hit hard, they decided to drink to relieve their sorrow. At this time, Su Bai was held up by one left and one right, Unable to move, he could only say with a wry smile, You two heroines, can you let me go? My arm is about to break. Yu Nan spat and said viciously, If you don't explain clearly today, don't even think about leaving. Yes, that's right. Sister Li followed up, I just went out for a few days, how did you upgrade? I remember that when you came here, you went out for an afternoon and then upgraded. It's only been a few days now, and you upgraded again, and said, What are you from? Su Bai thought for a while and said, I'm just an ordinary person. A moment later, Su Bai sat on a chair and pointed to the pile of crystals on the table, as if identifying the crime scene. I hunted and killed more than 300 stone crystal crocodiles in the past few days, and then upgraded. Maybe it's my luck after all. Go to hell. Ah. Chapter 27 The Choice of a Pet Finally, when the dust settled, Su Bai was already wearing a pair of panda eyes. Well, I can only say that the Sky Steel Crow has a high absorption efficiency and can perfectly absorb the energy inside the spar. Sister Lee said, in addition, the Sky Steel Crow itself is a high-level beast that can reach the gold level in its entirety. So, I still can't accept things like continuous upgrades. But, that's the truth. Su Bai insisted. Yu Nan waved his hand weakly and said, forget it, this kid is very slippery, no matter how much he asks, he won't get an answer. Seeing this, Sister Lee could only let Su Bai go temporarily. Now that you have entered the bronze rank, you can consider a second battle pet. Yu Nan said, any thoughts? Su Bai shook his head and said, I still want to ask you guys. Then you are asking the right person. Yu Nan sat up straight and said proudly, 
based on my years of experience, it is more appropriate for your second battle pet to choose a battle pet with strong defense. Why? Su Bai asked, as if humbly asking for advice. Yu Nan nodded in satisfaction, and said, You also know that a beast master can project the power of a battle pet for his own use. Your Sky Steel Crow has very strong attack power, and the upper limit is gold level, so it is worth cultivating vigorously. Even if you contract a new attacking pet, it's just icing on the cake. Yu Nan continued to talk eloquently, obviously having a lot of experience about it. On the premise that the attack capability is guaranteed, what needs to be considered is its own security. Compared with the battle pet, the Beast Master's physical strength is weaker by more than one level, even after strengthening. Global Beast Master. My battle pet is twice as much as others 37. Chapter 37. Su Bai nodded again and again in agreement. That's right, although the Beast Master will also be upgraded when the battle pet is upgraded, and at the same time strengthen itself, but due to innate conditions, the range of improvement is limited. Battle pets with strong defenses generally have more physical strength and can project for a long time. Yu Nan explained, for example, Zhang Meodian's Flame Turtle, if projected, can provide a huge amount of defense, and even make Zhang Meodian Mao Dian face the spar gun's shots. So powerful, Su Bai was startled. The spar gun is a firearm powered by ferocious beast spar. It is a unique product of this world and has great power. The most important thing is that the projection time of the flame turtle can last for more than 10 hours. Yu Nan was filled with emotion, with such a defensive power, as long as it is paired with an attacking pet, it can face a large group of fierce beasts head on, fight. Su Bai understands, isn't this the same as the legend that while getting a lot of meat, the damage is still high. Yu Nan's words made Su Bai's thinking much clearer. It is indeed necessary to prepare a defensive battle pet. The phantom butterfly itself is not strong in defense. The only magical skill is phantom dust, but it can only last for five minutes. Even if it can project the phantom butterfly for a long time, but with its defensive power, let alone a spar gun, even if it is hit by a car, it can die on the spot. Then besides defensive pets, are there other options? Su Bai asked. He can contract two battle pets, except for one defensive type, and the remaining slot cannot be left empty. Yu Nan talked for a long time, his mouth was dry, and he didn't answer right away. Sister Lee said from the side, the alternative is the mount type battle pet. For example, all kinds of horse beasts. What's the point? Su Bai asked. Sister Lee said, actually, it's a matter of the beast master's own safety. Although the defensive pet has strong defense, speed is not its strong point. If you encounter a group of ferocious beasts, you won't be able to run away even if you want to. With the mount type battle pet, you don't have to worry about this problem. Ride and run, no one can catch up. Of course, flying battle pets are also available, but you must choose a powerful one, otherwise the speed is too slow, and it is not as good as a horse riding battle pet. Su Bai's eyes lit up, this is also a good plan. What's so good about the mount type? It has a gentle temperament and basically no offensive power. Yu Nan curled his lips and said, the defensive pet has thick skin and strong strength. Even if you lose the offensive pet, you can continue to cultivate it. It will not be trapped at the current level. Su Bai nodded, what he said made sense. After all, once the battle pet dies, that field will disappear forever. And as long as the level can be raised, a new battle pet slot can be obtained, and there is hope for a comeback. The attack ability of the mount type battle pet is too poor, and it is very difficult to upgrade. Therefore, defensive pets are indeed superior to mount pets in most cases. Sister Lee wanted to refute, but the facts were the same, so she could only say, HMPH, every girl wants to meet her own Prince Charming, so I vote for the mount type battle pet. Very good and powerful. Su Bai was shocked, never thought that this sister Lee had such a girlish side, she has learned a lot. Children only make choices, I want them all, Su Bai secretly said, you must not know that I can contract double battle pets. But after some conversation, Su Bai also made clear his goal. One defensive pet and one mount pet. It's really meaty and can fight, and it runs really fast. Exciting to think about, then which of these two battle pets is suitable for me? Su Bai asked. Considering the nature of your pauper, there are really not many choices. Yu Nan said mercilessly, the most common defensive pets are all kinds of turtles. If you want to be aggressive, 
then the bear pets are the best choice. Good choice. Oh, by the way, the crystal crocodile you killed in the past two days is also good. Although it has no long-range attack means, it is very strong in close combat. Forget about the stone crystal crocodile, it's too weak. Su bypassed directly, and he didn't think about it at all. Yu Nan was a little embarrassed. She found that what Su Bai said was right. Compared with the attack power of the Tian Gang Crow, the general defense power was not enough. Then you choose a turtle, Yu Nan said, although it feels weird, but in terms of defense, it is indeed the strongest turtle pet. Moreover, Zhang Maodian's flame tortoise made Su Bai envious, and he really wanted to cultivate a stronger one. As for the mount type battle pet, let's use the horse type battle pet. Sister Lee said, the temperament is gentle, and you can ride it after just two days of practice. Can't tigers and leopards work? Su Bai asked. Tiger and leopard ride, how majestic. It's a pity that Sister Lee broke his dream without hesitation. Structure problem, it's not suitable. Sister Lee said, of course, you can ride it if you insist. Hearing this, Su Bai resolutely gave up his fantasy. Although Sister Lee didn't talk about the consequences, there must have been many martyrs in history, and they had already paid a painful price. Chapter 28 Monster Egg Warehouse Although it has been decided to choose a defensive pet and a mount pet, where to get a pet is a problem. Wild beasts can also be contracted, as long as they are beaten to death, they can take advantage of the opportunity of the beast's mental power to directly contract and subdue it. However, such a battle pet needs a longer period of running in before it can be commanded perfectly. Only as an alternative, the most preferred choice must be to directly contract the beast egg. With Su Bai's current rate of earning contribution points, low-level black iron beast eggs can be chosen at will. But there is a problem with most black iron level monsters, the upper limit is very low, and very few can break through to the bronze level, then it is really the virtue of the ancestors. Well, for the time being, Let's think that fierce beasts also have the concept of ancestors. Although Su Bai has evolution points, if possible, he still wants to contract with more powerful beasts, which can save a lot of evolution points. It's just that, with his net worth, it's not enough. Not to mention anything else, let's just talk about Yang Li's Fungulang. It is said that Yang Dongshu lost more than half of his net worth in order to buy this beast egg, and he owed a huge favor. Just like this, ordinary fengfang wolves can only reach the silver intermediate level. Global Beastmaster. My battle pet is twice as much as others 38. Chapter 38. Of course, middle level silver is already considered a strong one, but Su Bai is now in contact with only silver level beastmasters, and there are a few gold level beastmasters, so some beasts of this level look down on them. It has to be said that it is easy to go from frugal to extravagant, but difficult to go from extravagant to frugal. At the very beginning, when the system was not activated, Subai had only one thing on his mind, which was to enter the black iron level. Now, the silver level battle pets are no longer in the eyes. If he let other beast masters know his thoughts, he would definitely scold him like a dog. It's so annoying, if someone can give them a silver ranked beast, they will be willing to call him a lifetime uncle. Brother Su, if you are willing to fall into my sister's arms, then I can buy you a top quality battle pet. Sister Lee said with a smile. Su Bai didn't change his face, and said righteously, Sister Lee, who do you think I am, this kind of thing should be said in private. PFF'd, Sister Lee laughed, tapped Su Bai's forehead with her finger, and said coquettishly, you little cunning. Yu Nan rolled his eyes and said, if you are willing to extend your time in number 13 wilderness hunting team, I can help you apply for a battle pet from the team leader. This proposal is good, but Su Bai thought about it, and still refused, I don't want to be bound. Then there are only two options. One is to contract a ferocious beast with poor aptitude. Yu Nan was not angry, and said, either go to the ferocious beast egg warehouse to try your luck. Wild beast egg warehouse. It was the first time Su Bai had heard of such a place, and asked, what's that for? The Commonwealth seizes a large number of beast eggs of unknown origin every year. Yu Nan explained, you also know that the appearance patterns of beast eggs are all kinds of strange, even if they are eggs laid by the same beast, they may be very different. Well, I've heard of it. Su Bai took over the conversation, I heard from our teacher that it is impossible to judge the type of ferocious beast eggs based on their appearance. 
That's why, occasionally, civilians contract with top pets, Yu Nan said, and then pointed at Su Bai, for example, you. I, Su Bai thought for a while, but couldn't refute. In the eyes of others, there is really no other explanation for what happened to me other than good luck. From the iron beak sparrow to the sky steel crow, what kind of improvement is this? Of course, this is a minority after all. This happens only with the captured illegal beast eggs. Like the beast eggs handed over by our wild hunting group, there is basically no error. Yu Nan said, after all, they are all obtained from the lairs of ferocious beasts. Unless there are very special circumstances, the type of ferocious beasts will not be mistaken. This is true, so you know how lucky you are. Sister Li looked at Su Bai with a different look, and said, most of the pets of your age in the area are birds and beasts. And there are quite a few iron-beaked sparrows. Su Bai nodded, and remained silent for a moment. He understood the reason. His background determined that the ferocious beast eggs distributed to him by the Federation were definitely low-level ferocious beasts of a specific type. After all, the neighbor of a commoner is also a commoner, and his war pet is an iron beak sparrow, and his neighbor's war pet will not be any high-end goods. But, in this way, do civilians still have a chance to stand out? As if seeing Su Bai's thoughts, Sister Lee said, this world has never been fair, just get used to it. Su Bai was powerless to change the Federation, so he could only nod his head and say, I understand. By the way, what are we talking about? Yu Nan hurriedly said, she felt that the atmosphere would explode if it continued. Speaking of the federal seizure of smuggled beast eggs, Su Bai reminded. Oh, yes, Yu Nan continued, since we can't identify the type, we can only put it in the warehouse and randomly distribute it to civilians who are old enough, or sell it to those who want to try their luck. Su Bai understood, this is just picking up the loopholes. But having said that, the system has given him the ability to see through the attributes of his pets, so can he see through the attributes of ferocious beast eggs? Thinking of this, Su Bai couldn't help but get excited. If it's really possible, then wouldn't he be able to find the top-level monster egg from countless monster eggs? I want to try my luck, Su Bai said, wishing he could go now. Yu Nan was a little surprised, and said, judging from your prudent personality, you should choose the existing ferocious beast eggs. Why would you want to try your luck? Su Bai's heart trembled, and he said calmly, go and learn more, if it really doesn't work, I'll buy it back for my brother. Su Yan will be 13 soon, and will be contracted as a war pet. So that's it. Yu Nan nodded clearly, and stopped asking. Actually, with your ability, as long as you have a year, you can definitely prepare a powerful beast egg for your brother. Unfortunately, time waits for no one. Sister Lee felt a little regretful. Regarding this, Su Bai was noncommittal. There is a time limit for contract pets, which is a law that humans have explored within 200 years. After reaching the age of 13, the contract must be completed within one month, otherwise the qualifications for contract pets will be permanently lost. It doesn't matter, when your brother reaches the bronze level, you can prepare him a powerful battle pet. Sister Lee said, patting Su Bai's shoulder. Thank you, Sister Lee, for your concern. Naturally, Su Bai could feel Sister Lee's kindness, and said a little moved. Yu Nan interjected from the side, Boy Su, if you have time tomorrow, let's go to the Beast Egg Warehouse to have a look. I just want to pick a few as gifts. Okay, then it's settled. Chapter 29 Boy, Why Do You Have Two Girlfriends? Early the next morning, while Su Bai was still asleep, the door of the room was kicked away. Terrified, Su Bai clutched the quilt and looked towards the door. The culprit turned out to be Yu Nan, next to Sister Li. The two of them had packed up, and they didn't wear wild hunting uniforms but ordinary clothes. Seeing Yu Nan in regular clothes for the first time, Su Bai couldn't help but his eyes lit up, fresh and beautiful, full of youthful breath. But that's right, Yu Nan seems to be in his early twenties, but he usually wears a regiment uniform, with only a hard line vibe and nothing else. Brother Su, don't you have a sister in your eyes? Sister Lee's voice was very dissatisfied. Su Bai quickly put on a smile and said, How dare you, it's really that Li Jia is too dazzling, I dare not look directly at you, little brother. Only then did Sister Lee turn her anger into joy, and said with a smile, Your mouth is so sweet. In fact, what Su Bai said was also quite correct. After Sister Lee put on her regular clothes, she looked like a ripe peach, 
full of charm, and her lethality against young people was absolutely unparalleled. Even though Su Bai and Su Bai were human beings, they still felt very amazed, and some physical conditions that should have appeared in the morning inevitably appeared. Yu Nan retreated on the spot, blushing. Sister Li didn't care, and even wanted to go to the bedside to observe it closely. Su Bai was so frightened that he rushed into the washroom and escaped from Sister Li's poisonous hands. Global Beastmaster. My battle pet is twice as much as others 39. Chapter 39. After washing up, the three of them came to the gate of the camp, and Shang Xingbang was already driving there. Get in the car. Yu Nan waved his hand, showing the demeanor of a big sister. No need to guess, Shang Xingbang must have been arrested. After Su Bai got into the car, looking at the strong man's expression of wanting to cry, he could only give him a sympathetic look. Shang Xingbang couldn't bear it anymore. Tears spewed out. A group of people went straight to the city without encountering a single beast on the road. Fierce beasts have a strong instinct for wildness. There are three silver level beast masters here, and they will not be so stupid as to seek their own death. Speaking of which, it was the first time for Su Bai to come to such an inner ring urban area. The civilian community he lived in was on the outermost ring of the city, and he was not allowed to enter the inner ring without permission. This is the rule of all cities in the Federation. The establishment of cities by the Federation relies on natural defense barriers, such as mountains and rivers. First establish a core base, and then expand outwards one by one. Each ring is separated by a city wall, which is also the product of continuous expansion. After all, the population can only be emigrated if the city wall is built first. On this point, the Federation has done a good job and will not force the relocation of civilians. The city where Su Bai lives is called Shangdongcheng, and there are seven rings in total, and the place they are going to is on the fourth ring. Shang Xingbang seemed to be very familiar with the guards of every city wall, and the road was unimpeded, and no one stopped him at all. This is the treatment brought by strength. Battle pet is status. Soon, the car stopped in front of a huge building, Yunnan jumped out of the car immediately, stretched his waist, and said, I'm exhausted. Sister Li got out of the car flirtatiously, and said with a smile, You da, your body is not good enough, I didn't say you were tired. When Su Bai got out of the car, Shang Xingbang kicked the accelerator and drove away directly, his back was a little embarrassed. Don't you wait for brother Shang? Su Bai asked, although he could guess the answer in his heart, he still had to ask to show his concern. Yu Nan said casually, Don't worry about him, he'll be here when the time comes. Su Bai secretly sighed, Old Shang, you are so miserable. When the three of them came to the gate, a man who looked like a guard came over, saluted, and said loudly, Master Yunnan, Master Bayan, the box you reserved has been packed. The guard is probably at the intermediate level of bronze. In Su Bai's original seventh ring, Li Gang was also at the intermediate level of bronze, but he could be the class teacher, but here he can only be a guard. Well, I see, Yunnan said lightly, with no expression on his face. Let's go, Su Boy. Yu Nan turned his head and said with a smile, I hope that with your luck today, I can choose some good beast eggs. Sister Li's eyes lit up, and she thought to herself, why didn't she think of this, she changed her mind immediately, and picked two of them to go back. Anyway, the price of this kind of random monster eggs is not expensive, she can easily buy a car. When the three of them walked in, the guard breathed a sigh of relief, and muttered to himself, what is the origin of that young man, he is really envious to be able to walk with two silver beast masters. Walk into the beast egg warehouse, where the lights are bright. It is said to be a warehouse, but the interior decoration is actually considered luxurious, even on the second floor, there is a circle of boxes. Going straight to the second floor, Yu Nan came to the reserved box, lay down on the sofa, and pressed a button. Not long after, a middle-aged man who looked like a person in charge came over, bowed his body at the door, and said respectfully, You da, shall we start serving the beast eggs now? Okay, let's take a look at a hundred first, Yu Nan said carelessly. The middle-aged man turned around and retreated. Not long after, there was a slight sound of wheels rolling, and then ten carts entered the box. This box is huge, even if there are ten carts, it will not feel crowded at all. On each cart, there are ten beast eggs, and none of the surface patterns are similar. Yuda, please choose slowly. If you need to change the batch, just ask. 
The middle-aged man left after speaking. Su Bai was shocked in his heart. This man has the strength of the top bronze, but in front of Yunnan, he is so humble. By the way, they all call you Yuda. Su Bai glanced sideways and said in disbelief, could it be that you are the heir of a certain big family? Yeah, what's wrong? Yunnan asked back. Su Bai thought for a while, and said truthfully, I just think that women from big families should behave a little bit more. Yunnan was anxious, how could she not know what Su Bai meant, didn't she just think she was making a fuss? Boy Su, I think your skin is itchy. Yunnan jumped up, rushing forward to grab Yi Bai. How could Yi Bai catch him without a fight, he turned around and ran away. Fortunately, this box has a huge space to allow them to fight like this. Sister Lee was half lying on the sofa, looking at the two with a smile. The movement here spread, a middle-aged man passing by took a curious look, then changed his expression instantly and knocked on the door very politely. Young man, why do you have two girlfriends? The middle-aged man said with a smile, be obedient, give them to uncle, or uncle will beat you to death. Chapter 30 Ice Turtle Su Bai really wanted to say, if you want, quickly take these two scourges away. But he couldn't, as long as he said this, Yuda would definitely kill him immediately. In addition, this is related to the dignity of a man, so Su Bai said very hard, no. Also, who are you, uncle? Yu Jungchu, the vice president of the Spark Chamber of Commerce. The middle-aged man puffed up his chest and said proudly, I am a senior bronze beast master. Looking at you like this, I'm afraid you didn't even make it to the bronze level. Young man, listen to my advice, put your mind on cultivation, talk about girlfriends, and uncle will do it for you. Su Bai turned to look at Yu Nan, and asked, do you know him? Yu Nan curled his lips in disdain and said, I've never heard of it. Global Beastmaster. My battle pet is twice as much as others 40. Chapter 40. I haven't heard of it either. Sister Lee echoed from the side, but I think this big brother seems to be very powerful, little brother Su, why don't you go first? The heavenly king of arching fire is none other than you, Su Bai secretly made up his mind that he must never go out with Sister Lee in the future. Yu Jungchu looked at Sister Lee's body, with fiery eyes in his eyes, this stunner is absolutely top-notch. Yes, didn't you hear what this beauty said, you go first. Yu Jungchu said hastily, just as he was about to enter the box, he felt a strong wind blowing in front of him. Swish, the sole of Yu Nan's shoe stopped on the tip of Yu Jungchu's nose, and he said disgustedly, what a disappointment, boy Su, I'll give you three minutes to blow him out. Su Bai had question marks all over his head, hey, why me? I'm just a low-level bronze beast master, but this uncle is a high-level bronze master, two levels behind. What's more, I only have one battle pet on the bright side, and the opponent has two. No matter how you look at it, I have no chance of winning. But you uttered a big word, Su Bai could only do as he said. Based on his understanding of Nan, if he dared to say no, blood would definitely be spattered on the spot. You Nan would never mind a double kill. Uncle, it's not that I make things difficult for you, but you also heard that the eldest sister spoke, so I can only ask you to leave. Su Bai said very politely. Yu Jungchu showed an expression of disbelief, and said, you let me leave. Yes, Su Bai nodded and said very sincerely. I'm so pissed off, I want to fight you. Yu Jungchu was furious, but he still managed to reason and didn't summon his pet on the spot. Federal affiliated facilities like the Beast Egg Warehouse directly summon battle pets for no special reason, killing without mercy. The majesty of the union shall not be violated. Su Bai was helpless, why do people in this world fight duels every now and then, is it fun? The person in charge of the warehouse heard the movement and walked over, with a look of death on his face, he leaned into Yu Jungchu's ear, and said in a low voice, President Yu, give me some face, let's just leave this matter alone, is that okay? Quote. Yu Jungchu was taken aback, to make the person in charge here so humble, could it be said that this young man has a lot of background? But in front of the two beauties, Yu Jungchu was unwilling to let go. At this time, Sister Lee asked, President Yu, are you not from the local area? Yes, I'm from Yuan Shui City. Yu Jungchu replied. Yuan Shui City is about 1,000 kilometers away from the Upper East City. It is extremely difficult to cross such a long distance in the wild wild beasts. No wonder. Sister Lee nodded, 
then cast a wink at Yu Jiangchu, and said, Brother, come on. Su Bai knew what she meant, and he also understood why Yu Jiangchu dared to be so presumptuous in front of Yu Nan. It turned out that I didn't know him, so it made sense. But, uncle, it's really not easy for you to survive with this style of work, Su Bai secretly said. Boy, do you dare to accept a duel? Yu Jiangchu said loudly. He felt full of strength all over his body, and the amorous look of that glance made him fall completely. Su Bai sighed helplessly, although he didn't want to have a conflict with others, but the matter has come to this point, there is nothing to say, just fight. Why don't you dare, it's just that I don't fight in vain. Su Bai said with a confident expression. With the speed of the sky steel crow, coupled with new talents and skills, even if they can't win, at least they can draw. Good boy, you have the guts. Yu Jiangchu couldn't help but look at the young man in front of him differently, but when he saw Sister Li next to him, his blood boiled and he said proudly, Okay, since you said you didn't fight in vain, uncle, I will not make it difficult for you. How about this, if you can persist for ten minutes unbeaten, even if I lose, I will give you the ice-armored tortoise egg that was originally scheduled to be auctioned. Ice Turtle Su Bai's eyes lit up. Although it is not a flame turtle, the ice turtle is also very strong, and it is also a high-level beast that can reach the gold level in its entirety. If you invest in evolution points, the awakened bloodline will definitely not be worse than Fengali Zanying. Uncle, you should think about it. Su Bai said, once the duel starts, there is no way to go back on it. Hearing this, Yu Jiangchu couldn't help but feel his heart beating, and thought to himself, could it be that this kid has reached the bronze level even at such a young age? In order to prevent the car from overturning, Yu Jiangchu asked cheekily, young man, what level are you? Junior bronze, this time I'm here to find a contract with the beast egg. Su Bai said righteously. The corners of Yu Jiangchu's eyes twitched, wishing he could fly this bastard with his stomach. A bronze junior, or a newly promoted bronze junior who doesn't even have a second battle pet, pretends to be the same as a silver rank. Don't talk nonsense, just ask if you want to fight. Yu Jiangchu said angrily, he felt that he was being played like a monkey. Su Bai stood up straight and said, Come on, everyone, be a witness. I will have a duel with President Yu. The condition is that if I win, he will give me a ferocious ice turtle egg. The person in charge opened his mouth, looking at the confident Su Bai, he couldn't bear to look directly at him, this young man took it for granted. Although you came here with Yu Da, President Yu doesn't know Yu Da. The bullying you planned is impossible. If the person in charge thought about it, this young man must have thought that with Yu Da's name, President Yu could directly admit defeat and obediently deliver the ice-armored tortoise egg. Young man, after all, he still didn't think carefully, the person in charge secretly thought. Yes, yes, we all heard it. Sister Lee said happily, brother, come on. Miss, where are you from? Su Bai gave Sister Lee a sideways look angrily. The person in charge saw that the development of the matter had completely exceeded his control, so he could only look at Yunnan for help, but found that the person in the university said to him impatiently. Get ready, crazy, crazy. The person in charge was overwhelmed, and went directly to arrange the venue. Come on, you heirs of big families really know how to play. Bronze Junior vs. Bronze Senior. If I can win, I will eat upside down. Please like and subscribe.